23. A spring has a force constant of 100 newtons per meter and an unstretched length of 0.07 meters. One end is attached to a post that is free to rotate in the center of a smooth table, as shown in the view, on the top view above. The other end is attached to a one kilogram disc moving in uniform circular motion on the table, which stretches the spring by 0.03 meters. Friction is negligible. What is the centripetal force on the disc? Well, we have talked over and over about the fact that the centripetal force is no new force. It is simply the net force being exerted when the object is moving in circles. Therefore, one other force must be being exerted as the centripetal force. And in this case, since this is attached to a spring, it's supposed to be an elastic force or spring force that is acting as a centripetal force. Now, given that this is equal to K times the stretching of the spring, delta X, this means that what you have here is 100 newtons per meter times the displacement or stretching of the spring, which is 0 0.03 meters. And that's equal to three newtons. Therefore, the centripetal force exerted on the disc is exactly three newtons, and that is option B.